Hi friends, David here from Learn Stage Lighting. And in this video, we're gonna go ahead and look at Live Tracker's click track function. So for any song I've created, I can just go in and edit song, go to add, click track. So we'll pop this up here, add a plus, and then we get a click track. Now this is really simple. So all you do is enable or disable it, set your BPM, it's at 120 by default, set count in beats, which you can identify, you can set this only lead in to only do the, the count in beats, and then the audio subgroup to send it on, because naturally you probably want to send this on a different subgroup than your main mix, something that is only gonna go to your in-ears, okay? Then we also have the ability to set a MIDI clock or a MIDI tempo, send that MIDI tempo to be able to fire anything. Uh, if you're sending that through a MIDI interface, I would send that on a different MIDI channel than you're sending other commands. Last, we have the position. So we can set hours, minutes, seconds, and milliseconds where that goes in the track, or just go to the sequence review. You can drag it anywhere, but more often than not, you're probably just gonna do it at the start of the song. You can resize the length to whatever you need and then you've got your click track rolling. We'll save our changes, press play, and there we've got a click track. See, that was easy. Let's hop to the next video and talk about adding lyrics in a live tracker.